What a great day to be an American. My name's Major Ed Polito, United States Army retired and the Senior Vice President of the Folds of Honor. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the Folds of Honor Rock and Rays featuring my good friend, Lee Bryce. Here is how this show is gonna go tonight. You're about to get a full-blown, full-band, free concert from Lee Bryce. And he and his band have generously donated their time tonight to help us raise money for the Folds of Honor, a 501c3 charity formed to help the families of those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice. If you'd like to help out, please text GIVE to the number at the bottom of the screen or download the MySet app to vote for your favorite Lee Bryce song. And you can make a donation. The song with the highest donated total will be announced at the end of the show and 100% of all proceeds will go to benefit Folds of Honor and the families who have paid that ultimate price. I want to send out a big thank you to our sponsors this evening, Budweiser, Southeastern Grocers, Lucchese Boots, and Polaris Inc. Stay tuned for some special guests and a very special giveaway to a lucky viewer. And ladies and gentlemen, it is with my honor and duty and my responsibility to please welcome two-time ACM Song of the Year winner, six number one singles, and working on a seventh, I Hope You're Happy Now, featuring Carly Pierce, and another single, One of Them Girls, already climbing the charts. Ladies and gentlemen, my good friend, curb recording artist, and the awesome, awesome Lee Bryce.
Then the label be proud. little bear. We're going to shake off all those long weed blues. Ladies, break out your dancing shoes. It don't matter what night it is, it's Friday. It's Saturday, it's Sunday. I just want to hear you say it. I just want to hear you sing it one time. Here we go. Well, thank y'all so much for tuning in. So here's what we're going to say right here. Look at this cool can. Wow, so cool of Budweiser to do. To all of the men and women serving on the front lines in the military, in the fight against the COVID-19, y'all, this bud is for you. <laughs> we'll have to have a sip of this. Y'all ready? Get this party started. Cheers. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> so here we go. So look here. The drawing at the end of the show. We know that these are trying times for many of us. And because every dollar counts, Southeastern Grocers has agreed to match your donations dollar for dollar up to $100,000. So please give what you can. Every penny counts. And that's not all. Whoever donates the most tonight will receive a special guitar signed by my good friend Lee Bryce. Now let's get back to some music. Hoorah! The yeah, Armad Major Ed and Lieutenant Colonel Dan Rooney a long time ago and what they do the Folds of Honor and this mission became very special to me. I fell in love with the mission. What they do, they give money and scholarships to the fallen soldiers, the families of fallen soldiers, and it just uh, became a huge part. So I'm honored to be a part of starting the Tennessee chapter. And now I'd like to throw my good friend, Mr. Lieutenant Dan Rooney, a big shout out. Sometimes I don't know why you stay with me. I'm hard to love, hard to love. Oh, I don't make it easy. I could do it if I stood away still. I'm hard to love, hard to love. You say that you need me. Well, I don't deserve it, but I love that you love me.
full of grace, full of Jesus. And I wish that I could be more like you. I'm hard to love, hard to love. Oh, I don't make it easy. I could do it if it's too wasted. I'm hard to love, hard to love. You say that you need me. Well, I don't deserve it, but I know that you love good to be here. What an honor. Now, I wish you guys were all right here with me, but we'll make do. Because I know you're out there watching, so I'm picturing your faces right now. Cold beer in your hand. Girl, I'm glad you called. First heard you talk. Took me a second because I couldn't hear your draw And that don't sound like you Don't sound like you And that don't sound like you I know it's been a while I don't mean to pry But when I asked you if you happy I didn't hear a smile And that don't sound like you That don't sound like you No, that ain't the girl I knew You always sounded like a truck tires on the gravel road Laugh
first heard you talk, took me a second because I couldn't hear you. All right, we got a brand new song, y'all, coming up the charts, and uh, we just released it a few weeks ago, and seems like uh, seems like folks are liking it, and so we love that. <laughs> uh, guys, are we good here? Is this right? Oh no, that's wrong. Yeah, here we go. Oh. Sorry, guys, we got to make sure we're good. Is it? All right, wrote this song. Right before I went in to record, I already had the songs picked out for the first single. And I uh, had a feeling the night before. I said, you know, I just feel like writing a song. So went in the night before, and we wrote this song. And somehow at about 4 a.m., finished it up. And at 9 a.m. that same morning, we ended up kicking a song off the, the list that we already had and put this one on it. And then this one became the first single. So Cinderella story, I think. But uh, here we go. This is called One of Them Girls. All you want of them girls to peels off the bottle I'd label Just might run the pool table Roll your eyes if I call you an angel Ain't you one of them girls Ask you to dance you say Just to see how far I go Your song comes on and your eyes close That's when I know Do a shot now, come on now. You one of them girls that ain't trying to be nobody. You're just here for the party. If I'm wrong, then stop me. You one of them girls that ain't handing out your number. You like to make us want you. You like to make us wonder. If you one of them girls, cause I'm one of them boys, trade his whole for one of them girls who likes to act all quiet but since you're not even trying yeah you know i ain't lying damn right you one of them girls broke every heart in your hometown on the day you rode out and i'm always in all stars now To make us want you, you like to make us wonder if you one of them girls, cause I'm one of them boys, trade his whole world, yeah, I'm a one of them girls, you one of them girls, I want to put my lips on. Hold all night long, write a little love song For one of them girls that ain't trying to meet nobody You're just here for the party If I'm wrong, then stop me, yeah You're one of them girls that ain't handing out your number You like to make us want you You like to make us wonder If you're one of them girls Cause I'm one of them boys Trade his whole world For one of them girls Yeah I want a them girls Yeah, one of them girls Hope y'all are having fun. See y'all in a second. 
Well, what a great day to be an American. You know what? We were having such a great time. And I got to tell you, you know what? Freedom is not free. On this Memorial Day weekend, we honor the sacrifices and we support the legacy of those that have done so much for our freedom. And I got to tell you, you know what? I have the honor and the privilege to introduce our founder at the Folds of Honor, a senior vice president, a co-founding member of Folds of Honor. I have had the privilege of being with my hero and my friend, Lieutenant Colonel Dan Rooney, who has done some tremendous work to honor that sacrifice, to educate the legacy, to make sure that families like mine have that opportunity for an educational start. support the families of our fallen and disabled veterans. God bless America. And we're back. And guess what? We get to read some of the fan mail that we have. You know what? And also encourage donations. Remember, every dollar counts. And at Southeastern Grocers, they are matching every dollar tonight. And don't forget to donate at least $10 if you want to be entered in the Lucchese Boots giveaway at the end of the show. And also to get that signed Lee Bryce guitar. And let me tell you something, that's very powerful. Now, back to the music. Ladies and gentlemen, Lee Bryce! Last night, out of the blue, drifting off to the evening news. She said, honey, what would you do if you'd never met me? I just laughed, said, I don't know. But I could take a couple guesses, though. And then I tried to dig real deep. Said, honey, honestly, I'd do a lot more offshore fishing. I'd probably eat more drive through chicken. I took a few strokes off my golf game. If I'd never known your name, I'd still be driving that old green Nova. I probably never would have heard of yoga. I'd be a better football fan. But if I was a single man alone and out there on the loose, well, I'd be looking for a woman like you. I could tell that got her attention. So I said, oh yeah, I forgot to mention. I wouldn't trade a single day. A 400 years of the other way. She just smiled and rolled her eyes. Cause she's heard all of my lies. I said, come on girl, seriously. If I hadn't been so lucky, I'd be a shooting pool in my bachelor pad. I played bass in my cover band. Stocking up cold bun light for poker every Tuesday night, yeah. I'd have a back door in the shed, and I want to throw a pillow on the bed. I keep my cash in a coffee can, but if I was a single man alone and out there on the loose, here we go. Well, I'd be looking for a woman like you. Well, she knows what a mess I'd be if I didn't have her here, so to be sure, I whispered in her ear. Yeah, I said, baby, yeah. <laughs> you know I get sick, deep sea fish, and you make the best fried chicken. I got a hopeless golf game. I love the sound of your name. I might miss that old green Nova, but I love watching you do yoga. I'll take a gold band on my hand over being a single man. Cause honestly, I don't know what I Truth. 
All right. So here we go. It's a little odd not having my folks out here in front of me. Like I said, I'm picturing you right out here. Here is a song that I wanted to write my whole life. I finally did, and uh, it did exactly what I wanted it to do, and it still does every day. This is a song for my wife. Hope y'all doing awesome out there. Happy Memorial Day. They called them crazy when they started out. Said Seventeen's too young to know what love's about. They've been together 58 years now. That's crazy. He brought home. 
67 bucks a week Bought her a little two-bedroom house on Maple Street Where she blessed him with six more miles to feed That's crazy Just ask him how he did it He'll say pull up a seat It'll only take a minute to tell you everything, be your best friend, tell the truth, don't use I love you, go to work, do your best, don't outsmart your common sense, never let your praying knees get laid, and love like crazy, you know they called him crazy. Quit his job. Said them home computers, boy. They ain't ever gonna take off. Yeah, right. He sold his one man shop to Microsoft. And Microsoft paid that old country boy like crazy. Just ask him how he made it. He'll say, pull up a seat. It'll only take a minute. But you tell me. Thank y'all so much for hanging out with us right here on Memorial Day. What a great night. Guess what? We continue to get donations in. I am just so honored, privileged that I get to MC this evening for you because I represent Folds of Honor. My two little girls, Caitlin and Kinsley, are scholarship recipients of the foundation. On behalf of the 24,500 scholarships that have been awarded, we want to thank all of you. But we also want to you know, tell you, we want you to give tonight because it is so powerful that we can honor the sacrifice, we can educate the legacy, and we can make sure that we don't leave a family behind on the field of battle. And the way that you can do that is you can go to text the word GIVE and go to 833-843-1313, and guess what? Make a difference. And I'm seeing all the great comments there on social media and all the platforms, and guess what? You know what? I want to say to all of you out there, my good friend Matt Wright even wrote something. You know what? Thank you. Thank you for your sacrifice that you make for us to give us the freedom that we have in this nation by providing the support for our military families. To me, that is so important. But I also want to, you know, give a big shout out to Budweiser, the king of beers. And guess what? I love Budweiser. You look at this can and you see all the logos, you see the Folds of Honor logo, and that to me is so powerful. But what the, is most, most powerful to me is the $17 million that they donated since 2011 to honor the sacrifice, to educate the legacy, and to make sure that these families are taken care of. And you know what? To the king of beers, guess what? Salute to all of the troops and their families. Hoorah! And now to my friends at Southeastern Grocers, Winn-Dixie, Bilo, Fresco Emas, and Harvey's, Harvey's stores are having a roundup program during this time. And from now till July 4th, 
They have already donated $100,000 to Folds of Honor, and they're going to match those donations tonight up to another 100000 I got to tell you, that is one powerful group. And go and see them because they are making a difference on behalf of our families. And you know what? There are also, also many people that are doing so many incredible things for us. And guess what? Lucchese Boots is giving a portion of all their sales this weekend two folds of honor and also donating a $5,000 scholarship tonight. And they are going to give away a pair of those limited edition folds of honor boots. And I'm telling you, they are so awesome. If you can see on the picture, but the great thing about it is that also Lee gets to pick the winner this evening. And guess what? By donating $10, you can be a difference maker in America tonight. And guess what? Freedom is not free. I love all of you. I thank you. And guess what? These boots will only be available from them tonight and in the future by making $5,000 of a donation to the Folds of Honor. And guess what? You can text it. You can donate it. You can go to our website. You can, you know what? Like our pages that we have on all our platforms. And guess what? Link up with Budweiser and all of our friends that are making a difference on behalf of these military families. And finally, Polaris. Guess what? They are so awesome. They are making a difference by making sure that, you know what, they support the troops. They've already given a scholarship. They've already supported this event tonight, and they are giving back because guess what? They understand that freedom is not free, and they also understand that Lee Bryce stands for the Folds of Honor Foundation. Hoorah! Well, Major Ed, you couldn't say any better, brother. Y'all you know, should give a big old applause to Major Ed right now because he's the man. That's right. I can't hear you, but I can feel you. <laughs> Speaking of families. Boy, you gonna know it all. You'll think you're ten feet tall. You run like you're bulletproof and total a car too. Boy, you gonna hate this town. I wish you could burn it down. But that fire in your eyes is twenty counties wide. But boy, you gonna love seventeen. Boy, you'll do some stupid things. You're going to drive and kiss and throw a punch and grow up way too fast. You're going to drop the ball, hit the wall, and break some hearts like glass. I know you will. You are part of me, but a part of you will always be. Boy, you gonna be so stubborn, but you get that from your mother. I already see it now. You weren't built for backing down. Boy, there'll be a small town night. And you'll fall for her sky blue eyes. And when she's in your hands, you'll think you're a man and not a boy. She'll make you lose your boy should be every reason why you gonna drive a kiss and throw a punch and grow up way too fast you gonna drop the ball hit the wall and break some hearts like glass I know you will cause you're a part of me and a part of you will always It's 3 a.m. and I give anything to get you back to sleep. But that face will be the same one in the review the day I watch you leave. But boy, you 
you're going to come back home. You're going to settle down. But you won't feel the way I'm feeling now. Till you have a boy. He's going to know it all. He'll think he's ten feet tall. He'll run like he's bulletproof. And total a car too. Thank y'all. All right, so, uh, so uh, here we are in the middle of a beautiful night. So we haven't been able to play a show in three months, and so we're so excited to be up here. Um, it's kind of different because I can't see your faces, but I can see them in my head. So I'm picturing y'all partying like rock stars out there. But uh, we love you, and we appreciate what you're doing tonight. Uh, contribute. Uh, bring it all. This is a beautiful night and a beautiful thing. Folds of Honor, they have... Uh, they have started and continued to push through many hurdles and become uh, such a major, major part of so many people's lives. Uh, so make sure you contribute, and uh, we're going to do something here. This is uh, actually a song that uh, uh, <coughs> my good friend, Miss Carly Pierce, wrote. And it's all of this is her story, and uh, it's her song. But she asked me to be a part of it, and uh, I feel so blessed to be a part of it. So... <laughs> Because it's doing so well, um, uh, I just thought we should play this tonight. So I'm going to try to do her part, but uh, I'm not a girl, so you got to imagine me being a girl for this first verse. But anyway, uh, <laughs> this is called I Hope You're Happy Now. Hey, it's all on me, it's my mistake. I said I don't love you a little too late But I guess there ain't ever a right time And I don't know why it's called a goodbye So go run my name into the ground Tell everyone you know just how I'm gonna slam the door on all forever But I promise you it's for the best
Thank y'all very much. Thank you, Charlie Pierce. All right, let's get back to this party now. Y'all got the best man in the world up here. Mr. Paul, Mr. Michael, Reggie Bradley Smith, Travis, and Donnie. My band, the Love Cannons, have been with me for a long time, stuck with me through thick and thin. And we like to party, so here's one of them. Yeah, this is called Parking Lot Party. He has called the grill. We got 24 tall boys on the chill. A 14 of mine. A little monster tucker on the radio. Can't you see? We gonna catch a little groove before the show. We ain't playing nothing slow in the parking lot party. I tell you, wait, buzz, just a sipping on such. I ain't ever too early. You might want to feel up because Cause I ain't no party like the pre-party And after the party, the after party Parking lot party Well, the yoga band is doing sound checks I ain't even got no tickets yet now What he said Guitar out. Oh, 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 it's about time to pass the moonshine around. Hey, 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 hey. This show's about to start, but we ain't about to leave. Hey, 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 hey. It's one to hell of a time, and it's all for free. In the parking lot party, I'll tell you, baby, just a ship and no shirts. I ain't ever too early. What a great night. The donations keep coming in. I want to thank all of our donors out there. Hey, give $13 because that is the lucky number in sets that we, we try to do with the $13 is provide these scholarship funds to these military families. And guess what? Southeastern Grocers, thank you for your generosity this evening. We are doing something very powerful. And guess what? You are honoring the sacrifice and you're educating the legacy of our military families. And now I get to introduce one of my favorite songs and guess what lee is so awesome it's time to drive the truck hoorah to everybody all my military that we are here for tonight but also the other folks that are on the front lines of this war that we're in right now 
our nurses, everybody in the medical field. A lot of folks who don't get that recognition. We want you to know that we know that you are our soldiers in this moment. And we love you and we appreciate you. And so this is, uh, this is a song for you tonight. A song to remember all the folks we've lost to the service of this country. Eighty-nine cents in the ashtray, half empty bottle of Gatorade rolling in the floorboard. That dirty Braves cap on the dash, dog tags hanging from the rear, old score cannon cowboy boots and a gold army shirt folded in the back. This thing burns gas like crazy. That's all right. People got their ways of coping. And I got mine. I drive your truck. I roll every window down and I burn up. Every back road in this town, I find a feet. I tear it up to lost pain to cloud. Sometimes I drive you I leave that radio play Same old country station Where you left it Yeah man I crank it up You probably punch my arm right now If you saw this tear if yeah, man, I'm trying to be tough Oh, but mom asked me this morning If I'd been by your grave But that flagstone ain't where I feel you anyway I drive your truck I roll every window down And I burn up Every back row I drive your truck I roll every window down And I burn up Every back road in this town I find a fear I tear it up To all the pains A cloud of dust Yes, sometimes Brother, sometimes I drive your truck I drive your truck. I hope you don't mind. I know you don't mind. I drive your truck. Yeah. Y'all gave me your service. What a night it has been. Well, <clears throat> I think it's time to do uh, one now. If you're ready to get back into the groove of things, we'll grab another guitar.
was laughing, tapped me on the shoulder, making a motion like a jog it any closer. They want to know what's up, why I'm still holding her, even when the song is over. There's a rumor going around. Shut them down, tell them all the crazy. I can do whatever you want me to do, baby. Or you can lay one on me right now. We can really give them something to talk about. There's a rumor going round about me and you, me and you. Stirring up our little town the last week or two years. So tell me why we even trying to deny this feeling. There's a rumor going round and round and round What you say we make it true This feeling, I feel it, don't you feel it too? There's a rumor going round and round and round. 
what you say we make it true yeah that's right <laughs> thank y'all very much y'all we love you everybody out there as we have said over and over again tonight come on up here my brother wow what a great night lee <laughs> my man hey i gotta tell everyone from the bottom of my heart thank you for all you do lee you and the band enzo chris king anthony all the folks that are here i want to say thank you losing my leg was one of the most powerful things that has ever happened to me in my life but your music brings joy to people like me and so many other people. And during this time of pandemic and negativity, it's great that the band tonight can do something purposeful for others and bring light to a negative situation. And as you give generously tonight, I want you to go to the Winn-Dixies of the world and buy a case of Budweiser, put your Famous boots on, right? <laughs> you got them I on, got baby. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted you to say that. <laughs> and you know what? <laughs> you got them on, baby. Luke Casey. <laughs> and guess what? And Polaris, sponsoring this event tonight. Huge. But you know what? Before we wrap up, there's a drawing that we've had to this evening. And guess what? These Luke Casey Folds of Honor boots are powerful. You know what? That logo stands tall. And with our Friends at Budweiser, Southeastern Grocers, Lucchese, Polaris, and so many other sponsors. Our Tennessee chapter of Folds of Honor and all the chapters that we have around the country that we know, you know what? We will never leave a family behind on the field of battle. And that to me, Lee, is what you're all about. And uh, when I met my friend Enzo years ago and he, and he brought me together, not only with you, but with others, that you know what? I know that I always have family and that I know that you're part of something gr of greater good. And so on behalf of Folds of Honor, Lieutenant Colonel Rooney, all of our sponsors, all of our listeners out there, I want to thank you for making sure that you know what, you understand that freedom is not free. And so tomorrow we get a chance to, who's coming up tomorrow? Tyler, I think Tyler's coming tomorrow. Tyler uh -oh. Farr, one of my great friends, Tyler. And who's and else? Who's on the queue after that? I think that? the next day is Justin Moore, right? Justin Moore's going to be here Wednesday. So this is this thing is going to keep going. It is going to keep and going. It, and they're going to they're going to kill it. So if you tune in tonight, uh, make sure you tune in uh, tomorrow and the next night. This is going to be great. Uh, it was already fun for us. So yeah, it's going to be fun for them. And you didn't have and and Lee didn't have to do this. So I know. Hey, big a round of applause, way way out there, all over the country. Budweiser, the king of beers. You know, our grocery folks doing something very powerful. And you know what? At the end of the day, we got to announce a winner. And so <laughs> I got my cue cards here? right here. Yeah, man. And oh. you know what? Uh-oh. I want you to announce it. Okay. So um, our top donor tonight was? Top donor tonight was Damian Novak. Where are you? Damien Novak. Novak. <laughs> what a name, huh? Thank you so much. Y'all, seriously, thank you so much, Damien, for your, uh, your contribution. It's awesome. Uh, if you're the top donor, that is cool. So we will uh, we'll find you wherever you are, Damien. Yeah, and, and uh, by the way, we got a. Uh, um, we may need to sign one of those yeah, King we'll of Beers, Budweiser, Budweiser beer, baby. Sign a guitar and Don't we have? We got Budweiser in the house. Okay, and what? <laughs> and the song with the most dollars tonight. Oh man! I drive your truck. And then second. Boy. Yes. Boy was second. That's cool. Woman like you. Okay, good. That's good to know. I like I like that input. And then, okay, who's going to win the boots, baby? Okay, here's Come on boots. now. Hey, I want some boots, too. I'm telling you, these are some would, you, uh, would I look good in boots? You put these boots on before you walk out of the store, they feel like tennis shoes. I'm ready, baby. Come on. All right. Hey, there's a new sheriff in town. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right. All right. Who's our boot winner? I want you to say that. All right. Luke Nanette, Casey, right? Nanette. In fact... Nanette, Sarah Nanette. Nanette is my, s my wife's middle name, and it's tattooed right here on my arm. Oh, what an See? incredible. Wow. Nanette Snyder, you have got the Luke Casey boots. So, Nanette, wherever you are, thank you, first of all, for your uh, donation. And, uh, wow. Hit it, son. Well, I got to hit it. And, you know, um, again, 
on behalf of my two little girls who are scholarship recipients and the 24,500 scholarship recipients that we've had at the Folds of Honor, um, how incredible it is that uh, Folds of Honor was started by Lieutenant Colonel Dan Rooney on a mission on a United Airlines flight, and he would witness what no one ever wants to witness, and that is what Memorial Day is all about, is honoring that sacrifice, educating the legacy, and making sure that, you know what, no one gets left behind. It's about honoring and remembering, and guess what? But it's also about celebrating the greatest nation in the world, the United States of America. And now we're going to show you the mission video. I'm going to sign out. Major Ed in the house, coming in hot to Nashville with Lee Bryce. God bless the United States of America. God bless Lee Bryce. Hoorah! Woo! There's a term I love in life, synchronicity. I define that as chance with a purpose. And one fateful night, my life would change forever. Um, I was flying from Chicago here to Grand Rapids, Michigan. It was United Flight 664. Finally get on this airplane, I walk through first class and um, I see this kid, he catches me off guard because he's a corporal sitting in dress army green. And I go sit um, and coach and about an hour and a half or so later, we land in Grand Rapids, Michigan. As we pull up to the gate, the captain comes over the PA and um, says that we have an American hero on board. And my mind immediately jumps to this kid in first class, right? And I was like, what did he do? I'd just gotten back from uh, my second tour of duty in Iraq flying the F-16. And um, he continues the captain by uh, informing us that we are carrying the remains of Corporal Brock Buckland on this flight. And his identical twin brother, Corporal Brad Buckland, was in first class and has brought him those 7,000 miles home. Captain makes another request that everybody stay in their seats until his remains had been removed from the right cargo hold. And um, that night I watched um, the other side of war. Uh, as I looked out on the tarmac, uh, the Bucklands on the darkest night of their lives. Uh, the thing that really got me though was his, uh, his four-year-old son. Sat right below the cargo ramp as that American flag draped coffin inched down. And the finality of the sacrifice hit me. Um, the realities that this young boy would never play catch with his dad again. He would never be tucked in at night. And that term freedom isn't free didn't mean anything until I witnessed that. And as the ceremony finishes itself up, you know, I wipe away my tears, right, and I grab my backpack and I look back to the airplane only to see that more than half the plane had gotten off. No place to go except that blanket of freedom we'll all sleep under each and every night courtesy of one percent of this country that suits up every day willing to defend and pay the ultimate sacrifice for the other 99 percent and that was my moment of synchronicity i knew with every fiber of my being that god had called me on a mission <laughs>